Hi, everybody. Unmute yourself. Let's say hi. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> hey, I want to um introduce you to, so Adrian, Adrian is, hi, Adrian. <laughs> Adrian is how I found out about juice. Play. Your hair, the, I, I got your hair is growing. It's growing. Yes. I know. Yeah. I know. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a, so that's Adrian. Hi, hey, Adrian. Hi, Renee. Hi, Renee. And then, um, and that's Ave. Hi. Oh. <laughs> Ave is in Georgia. Okay. Yes. Adrian is in Temecula. Okay. You're in Mississippi. Yes. You and, and Barbara Ray, and then I'm in Maryland. Yes. And then Donna is in, Donna's coming. Where is Donna? Donna is, Ave, do you know where Donna is? Donna is. Donna she, Merritt, she's in yes. Northern Virginia. I think Arlington. Virginia. Okay. So um, let's see here. Yeah, we have people coming in. Very have, good. Yes. Very good. Yes. Yes. Thank, thank you all for loaning uh you know letting robin loan you for a few minutes <laughs> <laughs> i i teamwork, have seen teamwork yeah. huh teamwork 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 that's right that is right for sure. Yes. for sure and i think linda is trying to get in linda is trying to get in i can't see you or hear you linda there and you are oh hi linda uh, linda's from arizona and we can't hear you, Linda. Turn your unmute yourself. Let me see what I do. Yeah, oh, just, she has to unmute, but yeah. she's uh Arizona, right? Yes, yeah, she's in Arizona, and yeah. um, her product should be coming any day. I think I think it was supposed to come on Saturday. Saturday, yeah, yeah, tomorrow. it's supposed to come tomorrow. on tomorrow. Um, Linda, I still I can't hear you. Let's see. I uh, Linda, can do you know how to unmute? Oh, she, I don't think um, she have her camera. Linda, Linda, Linda. Okay, okay. I think I'm unmuted now. There you yes. go. All right. <laughs> Yay! It's um good to see your 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 face, Linda. Oh it's, yeah, it's Robin. Good to see you, ladies. Oh, yeah. Yes. Oh, you so, never met you never met Linda? Not not like in person. We were on the phone. I mean, no, on oh on the phone, but you never seen her face. No. Mm -mm. Okay. And there's there's Donna Donna. Donna, you're in Virginia. She's still she, okay. Oh, there she is. Are you yes. in Virginia? Virginia. All right. Hi, Donna. Hi. How are you? Hi, nice to meet you. <laughs> Thank hey, you. Hi. Hello. So, yeah, people Hi. are coming on in. People are coming in. So, so while people are coming in, let's introduce ourselves. So I'm Renee Michelle Floyd, and um, Robin told you know shared the Juice Plus with me what three, four, five years ago, and yes, yeah. And so I was on them like three years ago, and then I stopped, and um, because we moved, and you know how you things life happen and you just get off of them and and so I just felt hey uh Debbie hi <laughs> so hi. we unmute yourself and hey lady so, how's it going good good <laughs> yeah we have a we have a a, a room full almost <laughs> yeah oh, and so we're just going by and introducing ourselves so I won't give you my story yet uh, anyway Robin introduced me to juice plus a few years ago and i just came back on them just uh signed up i saw you all last week on thursday or the week before last i had my camera off but i'm telling you i was working right here and listening and saying because i had been praying that i need to get back on these and so i got here and just went crazy so <laughs> now so do you want us do you want them to tell their stories or you just want us to to just no, say I, do. I want them to tell their stories first let me just introduce linda and debbie they're okay. um they are my club members they um i have a, a club called beautiful locks club and so they are uh two ladies um uh, that's a club member uh of the club and then i told them about them and then they signed up and so 
Yes. Yeah, so if you all want to introduce yourselves, you can, and then we'll let Robin take over. <laughs> yeah, I'll do. I'll go last. But I also want you to tell the those that don't know you, you you said your club. So you do what hair? I mean, I want you to tell them that so the people that don't know. Oh, you. okay, okay. Yes. Yeah, so I'm a retired certified Sister Locks consultant. So I used to do this hairstyle. So now I sell the products. I, I make my own products as well. So I have my proprietary products for locks, uh, sister locks, dreadlocks, braids, twists. Um, and so I have this club called Beautiful Locks Club that I just launched and started. Um, and it's especially, I, I really, my message is really for those who have sister locks, but I can see quickly that it's just going to be a lock club whether you have sister locks or not. And so um, so now I run that club um, and I sell my products. That's, yeah. a, that's it in a nutshell. <laughs> and I'm happy that you said you're going to open it up because I don't have sister locks. I have traditional locks. Right, right. But I don't want to be left out of the club. Okay. So I, um, I'll go last, but since I know, you know, I, I guess I see everybody in the screen. Ave, can you introduce yourself and then tell your story? I just heard about your story yesterday or a couple days ago, and I was blown away. Okay, hi, my Linda. name is Ave Marie Cunningham, and I am a sales coordinator with the Juice Plus uh, company. And my story is, uh, before I was introduced to Juice Plus, I was suffering with acid reflux, eczema, respiratory issues, had a torn meniscus, uh, arthritis, bone on bone. And so with the arthritis, I was getting uh, cortisol shots in my knees every four to six weeks until I maxed out. <clears throat> and so after losing weight, <clears throat> changing up my diet and being on Juice Plus, eating Juice Plus faithfully, I was able to get off of all five medications that I was on. Didn't have to have the knee replacement surgery and no meds. So at 65, I'm feeling great. Still no medication. Even though I still have arthritis, I do not have any problems with achy, swollen joints. So as Dr. Sears would say, whenever you are inflamed, you have inflammation in your body, that's fire. So I was a walking ball of fire because I had issues, inflammation from my head to my feet. And so now is like a blessing to be able to walk around and not have any stiffness, any swelling, achy joints, nothing. My arthritis is under control just by nutrition, eating and better. You, and as the saying go, motion is lotion to the joints. I walk five to six days a week. And, and so you take, that, that's what I do. <clears throat> You take the fruits, the vegetables, the berries, and the omegas. So all yes, of them. and the omegas, and the omegas. And my my question for you is, and I like to ask this to everybody: When you heard about Juice Plus, did you did it make sense to you right away, or did you hesitate and wait a while? Because everybody has a different way that, that they said yes. But did you go all in right away? Well, I, I I was leery, but I was in so much pain, I was willing to try it because I wanted to do something natural and not have to be on medications because I was on five and working my way up to more. And mm -hmm. so I was in a danger zone where I didn't want to be, especially after my mom and all the medications that she was on before she passed away. So I know I was going into a danger zone area. So I really was trying to find something where I could start, you know, being able to get off medication if possible. So I went into it, but I went into it with some hesitation because it's like, Oh, you hear so many things and it's like, oh, but this will work, this will work, this will work. But then one other thing that was a good factor for me is that growing up on a farm, mm -hmm. eating fresh fruit and vegetables and, and everything, that part resonated with me. So it's like, okay, you know what? I know what it did back in the day. I didn't have any issues. So I'm going to give this a try. That makes sense. Yeah. It's like, just give it a try. What, I mean, what's the worst that could happen? It's just, well, exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. And then so, I have another part to my story because I have an eye disease called retinitis pigmentosa. 
And so with that disease, you lose your sight and it starts from peripheral and gradually work its way around to the central vision. Well, all I have right now is central vision, but being on the products, the juice plus fruits, vegetables, berries, and especially the omegas, because I take six omegas a day. Do so we? being on those products, thank God my sight has been it has slowed down. I haven't had a prescription change since 2018. Praise God. And so with my sight, uh, I do have some blurriness, but a lot of things have been able to come back into focus. Like for instance, if I'm riding in a car before it was to the point where I couldn't read license tags anymore. Now I can read license tags again. Wow. Mm -hmm. wow. Thank you for that. And mm -hmm. then I'm going to have Donna share. Um, so <laughs> Donna, before you even say what, what you noticed, did it make sense to you right away? Or were you like, I don't know about this? What, what, did it make, go ahead. It made sense to me uh, right away um, because our family, I knew we weren't eating up fruits and vegetables. <clears throat> I knew that, you know, you always hear that, eat your fruits and vegetables. Yeah. Um, but it wasn't until I met someone on a plane who told me about Juice Plus and the research behind the product where I understood why that was important. You know, the backstory on fruits and vegetables, you know, the, the antioxidants and all the bo um, bodily functions that need what fruits and vegetables bring to the body. And at the time, I was just stressed out working hours for dollars um, job uh, in corporate America. And my children, two at the time, were very sick, um, just sickly with fevers. You know, I was hanging out with the parents at Walmart all hours, getting fever reduction stuff, coming home, adding that with the tepid baths and all that. And, and, and then, you know, I had hormonal imbalances and and fatigue and stress and um it was just it was getting too too much brain fog and everything and what really drew the line for me was two miscarriages in the same year and so I prayed for something you know it had to taste good or I don't taste it at all and I tried different healthy things green stuff that just I mean, should I just go eat the grass on my lawn? Mm -hmm. you know, just I could. I, so for me, I needed to not have to taste still because to get it down. And that was the beauty of Juice Plus for me was the simplicity of these plant powders and how I could just take them in capsules or throw them in cap. Uh, you know, we have our Juice Plus complete um, drink mix and. That was a win-win. And I saw how our family got healthier. You know, I wasn't beating down fevers anymore. I was more alert. I was more focused. I, you know, things just really cleared up. And my husband, who was skeptical initially, yeah. eight months in, he realized his allergies were not kicking his butt that summer. And his cholesterol went 40 points into normal. And that was, it's military physical said that. So there were things that you don't see outwardly, mm -hmm. but they are going on inside. You may be trying to get rid of that zit, but your body knows your liver has some issues. So mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's the totality of the nutrition and the wide variety of the mm -hmm. foods that target all kinds of things and they work better synergistically. And these mm -hmm. are the things that I learned, not just initially, but over time through this great community that's full of health professionals of all kinds and mm -hmm. people who contribute of their um, selves and their, their professional expertise in all different ranges of, of like you, Robin, as a nutritionist. You know, I've learned things. Uh, from you a lot and the people that you uh, bring and introduce 
to all of us through the presentations that you do. So yeah, I just started telling everybody who would listen. And mm -hmm. they were like, you got to tell my mama and you got to tell my auntie over here and you got to, you know? And so I kind of, I just got swept right up into mm -hmm. this healthy lifestyle. Mm -hmm. I was doing it anyway. And then I learned that, oh, well, I can get my, my own products covered, you know, through this sharing I was already doing. So it just, it just blew up and um, I'm happy to say a year in, I got pregnant. And now this was a long time ago, Donna. You didn't just get pregnant to be clear. Yeah. Yeah. This was, because how long have you been taking Juice Plus? Well, it was actually a year since I had started taking Juice Plus. Okay. I had gotten pregnant with okay. other stuff. But you've then, been taking Juice Plus for how long now? Well, now, well, about, he, he, 21, he 22 years so old. 22 years. Oh, wow. Okay. Years yeah. And <laughs> I, I can honestly say healthy. And I'll just add this in real quick since y'all brought up the subject. <laughs> I got my sister locks <laughs> when I weaned this baby oh. 22 years ago. My sister locks are dropped. They're about at my waist right now. Um, my hips, and I had one big chop in 2017, cute little bob thing, and it's grown out since, but yeah, I'm total life change. I could go on, but that's another story. Okay. See, I can't see it clear, so I didn't even know you had sister locks. I'm sure they are beautiful. Oh, they, they, yeah, they are, I must say. Wow. <laughs> So 20, 22 years and yes. your, your, your children and your husband. And then for you, what have you noticed over, I mean, it's been, oh, oh you got pregnant. It helped well, you. Well, yes. And here's the thing. Life happens. Mm -hmm. You're not the same person. I'm not the same person I was 20 plus years ago. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. My body has been exposed to things that, you know, I wasn't previously. We all are living our lives and which is why we need the nutrition to battle all kinds of toxins and things and that mm. we're exposed to day to day. Thank God for our immune system that we don't have to think most of the time about mm. all the stuff that's hitting up on us, right? Mm. So mm. the main thing is, are we taking care of that immune system? And I say that because I'm so thankful for God bringing this a product to our family. Because the reason why we are having the issues that we have, we found out later was hidden mold in home. Okay. I'm trying to fight, you know, the craziness in our family gene pool you know, your cancer, your heart disease, your diabetes, your, you know, the whole nine. I was not thinking about mold. This silent killer that is, I'm telling you, mm -hmm. behind so much that people are going through and they don't realize it. They don't realize it. <clears throat> so without even knowing about that, our immune systems were being built up. Mm -hmm. You know, we were affected by it, didn't know what it was, all right? Mm -hmm. Got better. Now, the beauty of how this business blossoms, I was able to be home, raise my own kids and all of that. To raise mm -hmm. up. But I was home, more exposed to this mold. Mm -hmm. um, now, it may, enabled me to, you know, survive, Mm -hmm. <laughs> through a lot of chronic exposure, but it still had an effect. Now you can brush your teeth and you can floss, you know, but mm -hmm. you still got to go to the dentist because there could still be some going on in your roots and you know what I'm saying? And it mm -hmm. and to be dealt with. So the mole had to come out and it got to a point where it was definitely affecting me. And we had a whole thing. We had to move out of house and everything. And the beauty of just having 
through the years, having this nutrition constantly mm -hmm. working through me mm -hmm. and the education and the, the advice that I got about how to be my own health advocate, which yeah. I put on to others, was that I was told that my healthy lifestyle actually saved my life. Mm -hmm. And to this day, so I was diagnosed in 2013 and, of, and I was having issues since then in my lungs. Um, but they Because of the mold in your house. The mold, yes. Uh -huh. Yes. And um, so I was, I have not had any decrease in lung function. Wow. It's huge. That is huge. And the diagnosis I have, people kind of live in a bubble, like, you know, you just, you, you know, germs or and infection or just, you know, kryptonite kind of thing. And mm -hmm. And people can live very isolated, okay? Mm -hmm. I do not do that. I cannot do that. Got it. And I have, I live, I live my life. Okay. And I am not on any powerful immune suppressant, um, you know, corticosteroid, blah, 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 blah. You know, I don't do it. And what I've learned, I'm not saying Juice Plus solved everything. It was a catalyst right. for my healthy lifestyle. It was the beginnings of totally changing the direction of our, our health and what we did to live healthily, okay, um, since. So yes, drama does and can happen. Yeah. But it's yeah so important to be doing what you know you can do for yourself and to 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 have the knowledge um, to do that. and be humble to listen to people that may tell you things you may not necessarily want to hear like your story Robin with you know yeah, <laughs> yeah. somebody tell you about your bus <laughs> I know. And so Donna, I'm going to hold you off for just a second because I want to make sure that, um, but we can come back. My daughter calling me. That um, I want to introduce you all to Adrian, but I, I do want to say this in, in, the, in the essence of keeping it real is that what I realize in the Juice Plus world, the, the Black people are very few. And it's, it's frustrating because we are the ones where when we're given some healthy information, we're like, ah, I don't know, let me see. So I have black customers or as a nutritionist, I have white customers and my white customers are faithful. They're just, it's a whole different thing. And with us, we're skeptical and all of those things. And we're the ones that need it the most. And I'm so, so passionate about us and excited when we catch the vision and we're able to share it for us because we need it. Yeah, we Everyone needs it, but we, we truly do need it. I wanna introduce you to Adrian, and I wanna give this backstory is before I introduce you to her so she can tell her story. She's the one that introduced me to Juice Plus and she'll tell you that I was skeptical, in fact, the only reason I affiliated myself with the company was because if you can see behind me, there's, I grow my own produce and the, the Juice Plus company offers a device where you can grow produce. And that made sense to me. And I bought that and that's what brought me into the company. But I also looked at Adrian, she's white, um, but she has so much energy and I'm like, what is she doing? And at the time you were 65, Adrian, I think. And you were 65? I think so. And I'm like, do you know you're a senior citizen? Calm down. She was like carrying stuff. And I was not as energetic. And I'm thinking, eventually, I'm going to have to listen. Whatever she's doing, I want to know. I'm gonna let her tell her story. But when I first went to my first Juice Plus conference, there was probably, I feel like, three or four Black people in there. And I thought, oh, my goodness, this is awful. 
I was like, all the white people are getting healthy and we are just, just out traveling somewhere and buying purses or something. I don't know, but we are not <laughs> in here. And it, it hurt my feelings and it still does all these years later. But Adrian, tell your story and you can tell them how mean to, I actually want you to tell them how mean I was to you at first. Yeah, I was so mean. I was like, I don't need these capsules. I'm not doing that. <laughs> so, Adrian, can you unmute yourself? Um, and I met Robin. We both were, went to some. We both went to a different city that was working on getting more green and doing something for the environment. And we just really liked each other's energy, which was, you know, you just never know when you're going to meet somebody out in the community. I, um, so I shared. Um, she was very. She had her own product line but she saw of capsules and a protein shake and she was not interested. And I said, that's fine. But she saw, I actually had a business card that had tower garden on. So we got to talking and, you know, you just never know. And Robin, um, they talk about this business teaching us a lot of personal growth. I mean, Robin taught me about boundaries. I mean, she was like, not interested. Don't talk about it. We go to do these events and she goes, you can talk about the tower garden. Do not mention the capsules. Do not. And I would go, okay. And sometimes people talk about their kids being sick. And I'm thinking, can I like, take them to the side and just tell them about the chewables? I mean, it, it took a while. I mean, Robin was never mean because she's not mean, but um, where I could share the Juice Plus and I would make the protein balls with, with the Juice Plus complete in them. And I would do other things when we would go to events, but she really wanted me to not talk about it. And I didn't. And she also, the first conference, she said, um, I'll go. I'll go for half a day. And don't talk to me. I'm not going to sit with you. I don't, <laughs> which was fine because she just wanted to talk to other people. She didn't want me to just give her my story. And it was okay. And I really respected her. And I really learned about just everybody has their own pace. And some people aren't ready to hear yet. So I learned, I mean, I love Robin. I have so much respect for her. I mean, I think she's one of my favorite people in the world because, and she's taught me so much. So <clears throat> when I started doing this, it's been 28 years I got into the, the um, you know, what I learned in this company, we, we have a system, but everybody's unique. So I was told, I started the product because my sister had died from cancer and she was 46 and I was 45. And I thought I was gonna die too. And I ran into a friend, I was, um, actually I was a therapist and I ran into another friend and she said, oh my gosh, you know, how are you doing? I said, I was in a lot of grief and I was scared and I thought I was going to die also. And she said, I just started doing these capsules, fruits and vegetables in a capsule. They're supposed to be what you take to prevent cancer. And I thought, fine, even if I died, at least I'd done something because I was not about to eat a lot of kale. And, you know, people talk about changing your fluorescent lighting and all that stuff. I wasn't that motivated. I was very depressed, but I could pop a couple capsules every night. And I have never in the 28 years I've been doing this, I've never missed a day because I would say to myself, which is easier, four capsules or chemotherapy and radiation. So that was my motivator. But I, and I had no expectation except that I wouldn't have guilt when I died because I really thought I was going to die, which is sad, but um, I, it was awful. My sister was my best friend. So if, she, and maybe if she had lived, I wouldn't have taken it. It wouldn't have gotten my attention. So I, um, what was surprising to me is I took the capsules and the next morning I woke up without any brain fog and I didn't realize what I had. I just, I mean, my head was clear and I don't think I'd ever, I used to joke that my head was clear, but my hair was still frizzy. So um, you guys might relate to that. So, <laughs> um, so I just, but I never went, the clarity never changed. And I was talking to someone the other day about it that we forget that our health has, has been better. I mean, I, it's, I'm now 74, I, I just can't do the math. I don't know when we met Robin, but um, I was clearly a senior citizen when I met her, but now I just turned 74. I don't take any medication. I take vi the vitamin D3 with K2 from Robin. I take, and I take the juice, I take all the juice plus and I take the complete every day. And when I started, we just had the fruits and vegetables and then we added the, the vineyard and then we make the complete and then we added the, you know, the omegas eventually. But um, I I used to get headaches all the time. My parents got headaches. My husband used to have terrible migraine headaches and he stopped getting them. And we didn't realize it until someone mentioned some of had headaches. And we thought, oh my God, he hasn't had a migraine in quite a while. My parents started taking it. They were 75 when they started taking it. And they both um, just passed in 2020 and they were in their hundredth year. 
they took it for 25 years or 26 years along with me to the day they died, they took their juice plus. They both were taking the complete. And and the, com the story with the complete is, um, my sister-in-law mentioned that my mother was my mother was losing weight and she said, I don't think she's eating. And I said, I'm sure she's eating. My parents eat. They had caregivers that helped her in the day. And I asked him what she was doing differently. She says, oh, she just added her own shake every day. So she added the complete and it made, made her body function better. And she was able to lose some weight that she, I mean, it was interesting because they were like a Petri dish for me. We would give him something and see what happened. So um, my, fa my father was better with the omegas. It helped his skin. It made my mother a little bit more talkative and um, it just, it wasn't good for my mother. <laughs> she, she she was more uh, honored when she was, her was, brain was clear she was just, my mother was just bored and just used to like to irritate us so um i my my energy level that was amazing to me because i used to drive from san diego to la and take like have to pull over three or four times to take a nap because my parents lived in la because i'd be tired and i would just you know pop over for a 10 or 15 minute nap on the i'd get off the freeway and when i started taking the juice plus I didn't need naps. I now can drive to LA and back without feeling sleepy. I, I mean, it was amazing to me, the difference in my energy level. And that, that changes the quality of your life, that not having to sleep all the time and just having the energy to do things. And it took the stress out of worrying about my kids because the doctors go, oh, it doesn't make a difference what they eat. And I'm thinking, I'm sure they're supposed to eat vegetables when they were little. And, but they, you know, the doctors think, well, they'll eat they're fine, even if they just eat fruit. So my kids were 10 and 12 when they started. And um, my daughter was 12. And I remember hearing from Mitra Ray about this is changing the generations of your cells. And she just had a very healthy, um, well, two year, almost two, year old, two years. She had a baby at the age of 39. And he's very healthy and very smart. And she, took, she doubled up on her Juice Plus when she found out she was pregnant and used that for her prenatal. And he has always had juice plus in his system. He's, he eats it, he eats it, and she puts it in it. She opens the capsules. He also eats um, the omegas. He pops those in his mouth and he loves his smoothie in the morning. So we take it all the time. I can't imagine what my life would be like without this product. And when I, when I hear you talking, Donna, I get real emotional because I think, why am I not saying to people, are you, anybody, you know what I do? Are you open to hearing about me share with this? Because I don't, I think people already know or they assume they know. And I really need to say to them, are you open to a conversation? And if you're not, that's okay. If you're not ready to do that, I don't wanna get, I, when someone cancels an appointment with me because they're sick, I think that just pisses me off. I, you know, I don't wanna take the time to get sick. I, I wanna stay well. And some, I tell people the only side effect of Juice Plus is if you like to whine about how sick you are, it's probably not for you. Because if you're going to get well, that's where you focus is how healthy you feel and your energy. So thank you. Know. you're welcome. I, I think that um, what whenever I hear these stories, I, I'm always saying we just need more foot soldiers, more people in the mission. And I want to acknowledge and then congratulate Renee because she just, jump just do on fire <laughs> just like and telling telling everybody and getting and getting people healthy and that's that is what we need and just for that and so when you do it obviously you can be a customer and share it or if you are a part of the mission then the company will compensate you for sharing and and it's a wonderful thing uh renee do you want to say uh, do you want to say what do you want to say? <laughs> um, I didn't. I didn't tell my story, but I think you all have heard. Well, maybe there's some that are going to listen to the recording. So let me just tell my story really quick. Yeah, I am a nutritionist. Story. Yeah, tell your story. I am a nutritionist for 16 years, and so I have a company where I work directly with people using food and nutrition to build their bodies. And when I met Adrian, all I wanted to do was grow my own produce. I have my own product line. I did not care about these capsules. It wasn't until I was at the conference with no black people, barely. And I sat next to a black person and I did tell Adrian, no, I'm not going to sit with you. I was really, I was just, I wasn't, I don't think I was nice, but I did sit next to a lady who was telling me about the fact that she had cancer and that Juice Plus helped her. And my mother had 
cancer. And that is actually what opened up my ears to the capsules. And I said, I don't know if this will work, mom. I, I don't know, but this lady said it helped her. So what do you have to lose? And once my mother, and it's been eight years now that she's been taking Juice Plus every day, that's when I decided to try it because I felt like if this is helping my mother and I have a whole business with helping people with their nutrition, I now need to take it just at least to see. I had no expectations of what it would do to me, but I knew my daughter would get it for free. So I was like, well, that'll work. And then for me, when I started to take it, my nails started growing like crazy. So I didn't need to wear, pay for fake nails anymore. My eyes cleared up. They were red all the time. I didn't even know I had allergies. My gums used to bleed from inflammation. That went away. And then I had this dry patch on my forehead and that went away. So I started in my early 40s. I'm almost 50 right now. And I do not take medication. Most people do. But Juice Plus, I think of it as an insurance policy. And the more that I started to understand it, the more that I wish that it didn't take me so long to, to understand it. And I wish that I wasn't so like dismissive of it, which is what people do because they don't get it. This is the value mm -hmm. of having these conversations. To be clear, these the ladies that are on this call, we met through Juice Plus. I didn't know them. They are not on my team. We're, we're, we're on the same team in that we're in the, we love each other and we support each other, but there's no money, monetary relationships with them. I just met them in the community. And so generally, the because it's such a small group of Black folk, we try to lock arms with each other all across the country and really support each other because who else is going to help us if not for us? And that is a part of of our mission. So that is my story. It's been eight years and I share Juice Plus and I share the Tower Garden. And my mission is just to help more folk get this produce because we're, we're sick. People are sick and we ain't getting better. It is through produce that is helping us and food is getting worse and worse and worse. And people are getting more cancers and more all the things. And this is just, I think of it as an insurance policy. So that's all I'm going to say about that. Uh, Renee, you, you take over and I'll chime in if, if need be to. I don't want to take yeah, over no. and say too much, but I just, I, I'm excited that you're doing this and, and yeah. bringing, bringing along good folk that can spread the word too. Mm -hmm. Well, I, I know it, it, it takes time. We're so jaded as people, period. I mean, there's so many health I mean, one day you should take this and the next day you shouldn't. So it's really, it takes time for people mm -hmm. to understand that nutrition really is. I mean, people are now starting to see how tasteless food is in the store. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's nothing like biting into a tasteless apple mm -hmm. and that makes me angry. You know, mm. and so it's like it has to be a, a different, yeah, you know, because the 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 natural sweetness and the minerals and the enzymes and all that's in fruits and vegetables is what will nourish our body. And mm. when we don't have that, no wonder everybody is sick, mm -hmm. you know, and yeah. no one is really getting better. You know, the the land is depleted and all that. So I know, like Robin, so now. Robin was hard to get, right? But look at, she's a fireball now. So it's like the best ones are the hardest to get. So yeah. you have to, you have to, you know, be patient with people because it is a lot, um, a lot of news out there that something works. And then the next day you saying, you know, so I know, I realize that consistency mm -hmm. is the key. And so I plan to do these at least once a week or every other week because I know that it's going to take time. I'm not in a hurry because mm -hmm. I want to educate. I want people to understand, mm -hmm. you know, uh, more so. I'm not in it for the money. I'm right. in it to really, truly help others because I, I know so many people that's sick and tired of being sick and tired, mm -hmm. but they don't know what to do. You know, you said something that was, I want to reiterate because it's important is there's all these things, right? Do this, do, you know, it's like every day it's like so confusing, but what has never gone out of style, never is the need 
for fruits and vegetables. Have exactly. you ever heard anybody say, don't eat fruits and vegetables? Like that has always been true. Mm -hmm. And w when people understand that, and what you said is the apple is tasteless. The tomato will last in your refrigerator for a month. Like the, the food ain't right. Mm -hmm. what I love about juice plus and they've been around 30 years all of this produce they have farmers special farmers that are growing the produce in its highest quality and then they take it and put in this big grinder and they, they take the water out and they turn it into a powder and it has it's certified it's all the things that it says it is that's why people are experiencing these profound health shifts because we're so depleted and when we get the the produce in our body it makes such a difference when the when the produce is taken it's the pits the peel and the seed and that's like a lemon you're not eating the lemon peel but when you're taking juice plus you're getting all of that they're not discarding anything the the worse the food is in the the stores the better juice plus becomes because it's it's so authentic in what it is yeah yeah. I wanted to hear from Linda and Debbie as to why you decided to go with this. I mean, I just shared it. I made that little quick video. I was, you know, I was actually eating these things and I said, let me just do an unboxing. Right. And um, because I've been on these before. So of course I know that they do work. I know what happened in life. You know, you just get out, you lose focus. So I knew that I needed to do something else. And so that's why I just made that quick little video. And so, you know, I shared it with my ladies because I feel like when I learn, learn something that's good for me, there's mm -hmm. going to be someone else that, why would I hold that information? Mm -hmm. So I want to know from Debbie and Linda, Linda, you can go first. Why did you decide to do this? And then she even talked about her husband and sister and she had other people that, that she know that needs this stuff. So why did you um, decide to go with it? Unmute yourself, uh, Linda. She got it. I love it. And you see how long her sister locks are, Donna? I see. <laughs> yeah. And Donna, I didn't even know you had sister locks because every time I see you, it's wrapped up like how... Okay, there's Linda. Hi, Linda. Hi, ladies. Um, why I ended up doing the Juice Plus was simply because of Renee's brief, short video. Um, <laughs> the I'm have been a pescatarian for mm, 18, 19 years, and I I'm now getting tired of fish. And I want to go vegan or vegetarian. So I thought mm, this might help me in my pursuit of that. And um, Robin mentioned when um, I, whenever Renee brought her on, um, if you have osteopenia, or if you have high cholesterol or whatever, and I'm like, well, I really don't have anything, but do have a cholesterol issue, but I think I'm dealing with that. Unbeknownst, I had gone that Monday and had mammogram, uh, ultrasound, uh, bone density, and some scans done because I did have a parathyroid problem about eight years ago and had surgery. Well, the following day after ordering this um, Juice Plus, my doctor called and says, well, the mammogram is fine. It's negative, no cancer, but you do now have osteopenia. I'm like, I have what? So mm -hmm. I'm like, now, how in the world? And then they told me it's a thinning of the bones or whatever. I'm like, okay. So he um, said I need to take 1,200 milligrams of um, calcium and vitamin D, 800 or whatever, D3. So I went ahead and I got the vitamins because my initial response was, of course, panic. Bones brittle, thinning. Oh, what am I going to break next? <laughs> so mm -hmm. I got that. And then I, I took, and while I, um, I exchanged the vitamins three times in Walgreens. I know they were so sick of me because the uh, first one was a uh, horse peel. I'm like, there's no way I can swallow that. <laughs> but they said, well, you can cut it up in pieces. So I'm like, okay, okay. Then I went and looked and I saw some gummy bears. And then I said, okay, can I exchange that for this? 
that were gummies. And I'm like, maybe I can get the calcium. But I bought them. And then she says, but you're not going to get the D3 in that. So I'm like, okay. So I was leaving and I looked at the vitamin shelf once more and I saw a soft capsule. Anyway, I bought that. And then I'm like, why am I buying capsules and gummies or looking at them? I just ordered that stuff. So maybe, you know, I said, God already knew what I needed before. Right. I, and I had already, I've already invested in what I need for my body, but unfortunately it still hasn't arrived. So that's the long, short, the short of my long story, ladies. So um, I have, I had a condition that I was unaware of. And I think as soon as I feel confident, based upon what Renee has said, she hasn't led me wrong yet, that mm -hmm. once I get that, um, this is going to address these um, conditions. Uh, my sister just had a hip replacement. And so she's still dealing with some issues. And probably now I know it's inflammation. And so she's swimming and everything. And now she's just having muscle spasms. So I know, again, her body must be in need of something. So I'll, I'm hoping that um, Juice Plus will also be the answer for her conditions as well. And my husband... We don't even want to talk about that. He has so many things going on. He's on multiple pills to the point that he just threw them all in a box on Monday and said, I'm sick of this. I don't know what I take morning or night. So I called and got his uh, medication regimen for him. But I'm going to, in, well, in lieu of, in addition to, I should say, I'm going to also put him on Juice Plus in hopes that he can wean himself off of these eight or 10 medications he's taking a day. Mm -hmm. yeah. I always feel like I want to chime in and this is probably for another conversation, but, and I want you to just look this up. You just do your research. If calcium pills are effective to stopping osteoporosis, osteopenia, it's, it's really, I'm not going to go into this too much because that's not what this is about. There is no evidence that the calcium pills do that. It's dietary calcium that helps, mm -hmm. but I'll, I can tell you about that later. Um, okay. Calcium pills don't do a thing. And what they do do is potentially go into the arteries and cause calcification. That's a whole nother story, but that's my jam. And that's what I study. So um, I'm going talk about that later. But I would- We can, I would, we can I would, definitely have a, just a, a meeting about vitamin, their yeah, calcium yeah, especially. Yeah. Cause yeah. I used to swear so by we, them. Yeah, you, you talked about it too. Um, so we can leave that for another uh, in your within your community yeah. and have that conversation about yeah. calcium. Dietary calcium is what makes the most difference. And that is something that, that you actually eat versus calcium okay. supplements. Yeah. But Definitely we'll get into that later. That. But yes, God was looking out for you, Linda, yeah. and take your juice plus. I always tell people, take your juice plus four months consistently and then take an assessment because if you're taking all these different things but you anyway juice plus is phenomenal and it handles a lot of things we're deficient for many reasons and juice plus plugs in the gap but i'll be quiet on that i get real passionate like, oh my God. <laughs> and anyway. i i forgot i want debbie to speak but i also want my mother to speak as well barbara ray now she's a tough cookie honey i'm I was really surprised that she came and told, because when I first did Juice Plus, she was like, no, uh-uh, uh-uh. So this time she got, I mean, she was all, she's all in and we, she been taking her. So she'll tell her story too. Go ahead, Debbie. <laughs> I decided to try um, Juice Plus. Um, today is my first day. Uh, so I took it oh, today. Oh, yours came. Yours came. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And I saw your video and I saw how you were chewing them up. <laughs> so I wanted to do that. I wanted to do that. I did that. And, did you um, make a video? No. <laughs> I, 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 I'm, too, I'm too quiet for that. Too quiet. <laughs> but okay. um, I chewed it up. The green one tasted, you could taste the garlic in it. And yeah. the fruit one was good. Yeah, um, I know, right? It is good. Yeah, I, it, was, it, was, it was good. It was good. Um. But I, I decided to take them because um, I'm, I consider myself to be a, on a whole food plant-based diet. Um, I do not have my parents. Um, they died of um, chronic lifestyle diseases. Mm -hmm. And um, my mother died when she was 50. And so when I was like 49, I was getting scared because I was overweight, had high cholesterol, high blood pressure. So 
I ended up deciding to go on a whole food plant-based diet. And just from being on that alone, I, um, my cholesterol went down, you know, I, I improved my numbers. So, you know, I, you know, I've been working at it, you know, but I'm still, and I've been talking to my doctor about deprescribing my, um, my blood pressure medicine. She, um, cut it down half, she had, she half the dose and I was doing really well on that. And then she cut it in half again. And so I noticed that I monitor my blood pressure and I'm on like a baby hypertension med and it's kind of a struggle. Like I'm, I'm in a high normal range. So when um, Renee talked about the um, juice plus, in addition to me following a whole food plant-based diet, if I take that, I'm just hoping I want to be off all meds. You know, I want to live the rest of my life. I keep affirming to myself. I want to live the rest of my life on this earth healthy and well. I, I, I say that to myself all the time. And I just feel like the juice plus, you know, with what everybody is saying and, um, Robin, I loved your aging beauty video too. I saw that That's and I, I was really touched by how great everybody looked. Um, mm. I'm hoping that it will get me off the high blood pressure medicine and I'm a regular exerciser too. Okay. So I'm hoping that, you know, I, I my, my affirmations will come true. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. That's it. That's awesome. And that all of these awesome. people mm -hmm. are real people. Like when I do those monthly, like if you have a story or Linda has a story, I'll ask you, like, will you share your story? That's how th those people all across the country, I gather them up. I don't even know them, but I just ask them, like, how, you know, how is Juice Plus going? And I just hear the most incredible stories of regular people like Ave and Donna and all. And so the stories are endless. Um, uh, Barbara Ray, uh, Renee, you said she has a story. And yeah, I want to know too, what made you say yes? Unmute yourself. <laughs> Unmute yourself, ma. <laughs> Let me see. While she's doing that, what I love and what I realize now is that when we are over 50, that's when we're like, or later in life, we try, that's when we're like, okay, let me get it together. Like I've yeah. lived this life so far. I see the direction that this life is going. Let me, let me get it together. Mm -hmm. And most of all of my customers are women in their 50s, 60s, 70s, and beyond. And I like it because I love to see us all just getting healthy and thriving. Um, okay. Hey, Barbara Ray. Can, hi. Can you all hear me now? Yeah. yeah. All right. All right, <laughs> ladies. And I want to, uh, how is everybody doing, number one? Thank good. you. Well, good. Thank you. Uh, Adrian. I wonder, I, I, I'm a writer, so I write down things that's profound. When you said, don't, I don't want to take the time to get sick, that hit girl, that is the God's truth. <laughs> so I just want you to know, I want you to know that, that I'm going to take that to another level. Okay. So um, what I wrote down, I have to write down things so I don't forget. Okay. And so. How old are you first? I'm 80 years old. Oh, wow. I don't have, uh, in other words, I'm 80 years old. So uh, th this is my testimony. I choose to stay in shape by doing things with rhythm and purpose, which becomes my habit. My physical condition is genetic that's out of my control. And that is, I have a, a left leg a discrepancy. My left leg is shorter than my right. And that happened when, when I was in my seventies because I was in an automobile accident years ago. And then, then my mother and my sister had it, but it didn't affect me until I was 70. But also I have scoliosis. That just happened. I said, what? You know, but I'm still moving. That's the main thing, still moving, still staying in shape. So my physical condition is genetic. That's out of my control. My top priority to my health, wealth, and a peace of mind is taking care of my spiritual health first. 
My spiritual health improves my emotional, mental, and physical health, and everything else falls in place by the grace of the living God. Not that I, now that I decided to add Juice Plus to my health regimen, I am receiving added benefits. As you get older, you will need added nutrients and, pro, and, and that produces health, wealth, and a peace of mind. So I choose the responsibility to own my own body. Okay, okay right. so, 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 so that's it. So I just want you to know once I own something, you know, I I'm I mean I got it right there by my bed. I, I have my own little little routine how I do stuff. So I just want you all to know that there's no excuse for none of us not to take care of ourselves. There's no excuse. So we move, we know what we do to our body. Lord, go to the doctor. We we sit uh, I worked in the hospital for 25 years, so I got very well educated. But we, uh, people come to the doctor and the doctor come in and the doctor say, well, well what's, what's, what's your problem? They say, well, I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm here for you to tell me now. Now, you know, and I didn't been all up in that. Okay. I never, when I go to the doctor, it's, it's uh, because I'm still trying, I'm, 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 um, I'm because I got to, Keep up the regimen, okay? But when I go to the doctor, I'm I, I'm educating them to me. Mm -hmm. I don't take no medications. Carrying mm -hmm. a vegan, vegetarian, you name it. I haven't eaten meat mm -hmm. in for 40 years. Mm -hmm. So I just want you to know my first health consultant at 19 years old was my daughter, Renee. Mm. I mean, I was going through, that was the darkest time in my life. She said, mom, why, why are you eating hog head cheese? Why are you eating? <laughs> I mean, I'm doing it all. Okay. I said, oh girl, I, I, I'm in, 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 but let me tell you, when I saw her at 19 getting healthier, I'm getting worse. And I just started <laughs> that pride, huh? <laughs> it's hard to listen to your children when, when your children love you and they want you around so once I start seeing her and I said and then I met somebody in regards to the herbs and stuff so I just want you all to know that I love living yeah. and I want to live healthy wealthy and with a peace of mind so yeah. young ladies and Robin you always on fire always talk uh, to Renee about you that I love your art or you're authentic, you get to the point, you Thank are you. truly a business woman. Thank you. Okay. Um, I uh I know that I actually have to run off in just a little bit because I yeah, promise I, do too, yeah. Yeah. I wanted to ask you guys, I don't know if you guys can see this picture. Do y'all yeah. know Ernestine? Yeah, do you, I don't know her, but yeah, I've seen her around. Yeah. So Linda and and Debbie, you know her? Do you know who she is? You've heard of her. She's 88 now and she yeah. she takes she takes juice plus. Yeah. Wow. As a yes, yeah, she does. And she uses it as a part of her training and her bodybuilding. Yes. That's Ernestine, 88 year old. Ernestine and um and Ernestine Shepherd, 88, 88 years old. Amen. Mm -hmm. That's, That's it. And she takes juice plus. How about that? Well, so, I, I don't. I know the next thing for me is the tower. You know the yeah. the vegetable tower. That's the next thing for me. Um, and so that it's just it's just I'm just all in. You know, yeah. um, because I I know I have to lead by example, yeah. and I've been wanting to do that for a while anyway. So I just that's going to be the next thing for me. And I love but my I, tower. And I remember yeah. you saying, "Well, what about the?" The soil, that's where the nutrients are. And yeah. I'm like, that's where they should be, but they're yeah. not in this soil yeah. that we have. Anyways, thank you. Congratulations, yes. Renee. Congratulations, yes. Debbie and Linda for just saying 
guests and being here. And thank you, Ave and Donna and Adrian and Barbara and everybody for just being here and just sharing your stories. And congratulations, Bene, thank on you. kicking yeah. it all. So I want I want to do this. We'll get together and talk, but thank you all. I want to do this, like I said, either weekly or every other week. Uh, because I know there's other people that need to see it and need to be on it. So thank you all for your time, for your testimony. Um, I, I receive it. I know that it's true um, because of how I'm feeling already. And I just started, when was that, Monday or Tuesday? Mm -hmm. And um, I, that's all I take. And the D3 uh, K2 by Robin and, and yeah. these Juice Plus. I let everything else go and I'm feeling so much better. So y'all, thank you. This is a Friday evening and um, yes. and we'll we'll get together again. I'm sure I'll see Adrian and, and Avi and Donna around again. Certainly Linda, Barbara, and uh, Debbie. Okay, and yes. certainly you, Robin. <laughs> yes. <laughs> all thank right, you all have a great evening. Thank you right. again. Thank you. You're right. welcome. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Thanks. <laughs>